Section 1 Megan and Ken are deciding how they will spend the evening. Look at Section 1 of your listening test. You have some time to look at questions 1 to 7 now. Now we shall begin. You should answer the questions as you listen because you will not hear the recording a second time. First, you have another chance to look at questions 1 to 7. Now listen carefully and answer questions 1 to 7. Hello, Megan speaking. Hello, Megan. Hello, Ken. I'm glad you called. Thomas asked me to give you his telephone number. Is that his office number or his home number? I can give you both. His new home number is 9452 3456. Would you like his office number? I think I have it. Does 97314322 sound right? That's it. But the home number is 94523456. He moved in last week. Good. I've got that. Now, what would you like to do? Well, I'd like to go dancing, but Jane's hurt her ankle, so she'd rather not. That's a pity. I guess it means she doesn't want to play tennis either. That's right. She says it's OK to go bowling if we don't expect her to do well. OK, let's do it. I guess we can go dancing some other time. Well, I booked us some time at the bowling alley of Entertainment City. Do you know it? Is it on Smith Street? Down near the university? That's right. It's on the corner of Smith Street and Bridge Road. What time did you book for? The first booking I could get was 8 o'clock. OK. It's 7 now. What do you want to do first? Well, I think we should leave now. We can meet at the bowling alley. I can't be that quick. I have to call Thomas to start with, and I need to get changed. OK. I think I'll leave in 10 minutes and meet you in there. That makes sense. I'll take my car, so I'll be quite quick. I'll be out of here in half an hour. OK. You're so lucky to have a car. You can get around so easily. Well, yes and no. I often spend ages driving around trying to find a park. The traffic can be very bad. Well, that won't be a problem for me because I'll take the bus. It goes right past my door and I'll have plenty of time. Sounds good. Who else is coming? I think nearly everyone from the afternoon class will be there. Which class? The big maths class or the afternoon tutorial? The maths class. What's more, we get a concession for large numbers. That's good. I'm trying to keep my expenses down this month. So am I. I expect tonight will cost about $20. You must be good with money. I expect it to come to, hmm, nearly $40. So how are you going to manage that? Well, the bus is cheap, and if I come home early, I won't have time to spend too much. In any case, I have to be up early tomorrow morning, so I'd really better try to get home by about 11. That reminds me. I have to phone the taxi company for my mother. Goodbye, Megan. I'll see you later. Goodbye, Ken. Ken calls the taxi company. Listen and be ready to answer questions 8 and 9. First, look at questions 8 and 9. Now listen to the telephone call and be ready to answer questions 8 and 9. Thank you for calling Acme Cabs. Please follow the instructions on the tape. If you wish to order a cab now, press 1. If you have placed an order previously, press 2. If you wish to make an advance order, press 3. Please be ready to tell us your street number and name. If you wish to speak to the radio room supervisor, press 4. If you want to inquire about lost property, press 5. If you want to order a taxi equipped to carry wheelchairs, press 6. Your call is very important. Please stay on the line for the next available order taker. Hello. I think I left something in one of your cabs on Thursday. 
It was a brown paper package with an address written on it in green ink. Has anyone handed it in? That is the end of section one. You now have some time to check your answers.